Hi, I'm Rockham Sakura. Hi, Jackie Cox. Hi, I'm Jan. And I'm Aiden Zane. And, and we're, we're the, the queens, queens of, of Drag Race season, <laughs> season 12. Should we do a take 12. two? What up, world? It's me, Widow Von Du from RuPaul's Drag Race season 12. And this is Drag It Out of Me. I'm going to ask Jackie. Who's the fishiest queen of season 12? And also, who has the meatiest tuck? Um, I might be sitting between the fishiest queen and the <laughs> meatiest tuck. I won't say which one's which. Well, if you look into my eyes, you'll really see what the answer is. Yeah, catch season 12 to find out <laughs> which one of these queens the white one. has large <laughs> I swear it's just one big one and one small one. Okay, first question. Who should take a little bit longer getting into makeup? Who rushes that beat? For you, Sherry. <laughs> who should take a little bit longer with that makeup? Um, and who rushes that beat? There's somebody sitting in the back seat of the car that I'm driving currently that, yeah, you. <laughs> I just gotta keep my eyes on the road, baby. <laughs> I hate you so much. You know that? <laughs> The audacity, you got the nerve. The level of disrespect. The, the, the level, it's too much, far too much. All right, so I have a question for you girls. Yeah. Who should take a little bit longer getting into makeup? Who rushes that beat? I think we know that. I think we all know, can we just say it all at once? Oh, you, you only choose, she only chooses one of us to ask. I'm just gonna say Heidi. Oh, okay, I'm That's glad. Yeah. Team. If you had to switch wardrobes with any queen from season 12, who would it be? Or uh, who would you not want it to be and Ooh, why? Ooh, not nah, shady. Okay. Oh. I'm going to have to ask Gigi. <laughs> <laughs> who would, if you had to switch wardrobes with any queen from season 12, who would you not, not want it to be and why? Do I have the option of tailoring them to fit me? No. You have to wear them as, as is. is. Britta. <laughs> <laughs> wow, we're two very different sizes, you see. <laughs> oh, okay. Uh, I'll ask Aiden. Be honest. Who did Rue's makeup? Who did Rue's makeup better, Matthew Anderson <gasps> or Raven? Escandal. Um, they both do an amazing job, but. I live for Matthew Anderson. Nobody will ever be able to do Rue's face like Matthew. Now your turn. <laughs> That's deep. Oh, I was no, not expecting it to go that there. That was deep. What is that? I put it in my mouth. All right, let's see if I can read. Mm. To Britta. <sighs> Which queen got the messiest and untucked? <laughs> <laughs> It's funny that you asked me that question, <laughs> Miss Heidi in the closet, because I feel like you definitely got the messiest of that gig, life. girl. Life. Girl, the way the that you life. you you just had a lot of passion, girl, behind your words, a couple but, of them days. Behind <laughs> me, I was talking about <laughs> right. I I'm driving a car. <laughs> okay. Crystal Elizabeth Method. <laughs> oh, <laughs> these chairs are crazy, y'all. Um, which queen do you think the fans will consider the villain this season? Oh, okay, that's a well, good question. <laughs> if I have to be honest, I think that the villain of the season is Gigi Good. <laughs> <laughs> Honestly, I don't know. But she's very nice. We're all so nice. <laughs> okay, me next. So, what female pop star does not deserve a drag impersonator? Girl, I'm gonna tell you this. We've watched the show, and we know for a fact, leave Beyonce alone, okay, ah! y'all? Girl, let, let it go. Right. Let it go. Let it go, She girl. don't need nobody else doing that to her. Let it go. And I'm not the one to talk because I ain't the best impersonator. I'm, we don't know that, but baby, look, what <laughs> I will tell you is leave Beyonce alone. <laughs> Rock'em Sakura, which crowned queen were you surprised to see win? Ooh. Ooh. Mm, this is some shady queens, okay. Trinity the Tuck and uh, Monet Exchange, definitely. Um, the surprise that it was a tie or surprise that they won in that season? I'm surprised that they won in that season. And who do you think should have won? No one. I'm gonna put this in your teacup, girl. <laughs> this is some tea. Yeah, let's see. dunk it in. Dunk it in. No, Ooh. Um, I was Ooh, really, that tea is hot. Ooh, I can't even touch this. I was this. really, I was really Team Naomi. Mm. Um, she had the balls to pull on like Boot get rid of Manila. Manila. Yeah. 
Um, no, but actually my real answer is Manila. <laughs> yeah, I keep flip-flopping. So you have all of the answers. All of the answers. No, I think Manila really should have won that season. Um, she didn't deserve to go home, but that's the game. Yeah, you know. Mark. I mean, I was surprised that was the question. Also, they didn't like my promo look, so this is a vendetta. <laughs> and I oop, and I oop. Widow Von Du. Yes, bitch. When you walked in the workroom, which queen were you not that threatened by? <laughs> <laughs> I love this shady thing. boots. <laughs> I wasn't threatened by. Does that be one? <laughs> ah! <laughs> no, just play. Uh, I wasn't threatened by Aiden Zane. Oh, but she's so spooky. <laughs> uh, and that was comma. the answer. Thank you so much, <laughs> contestant I love all of my number four from Kansas City, Missouri. Thanks for watching Drag It Out of Me. We are the cast of RuPaul's Drag Race season 12, and don't miss it. You better be watching Fridays 8, 7 Central on VH1. <laughs> Work. <laughs>